So let's get in the kitchen so we can cook for that children and that man, y'all. Baby, when I tell you I feel like I did my big one with this one, but then again, I feel like I do my big one with all of them. So I got my veggies out over there, and then I got my red snapper. So we're just going to score the snapper on both sides. And, of course, you are going to clean it. After you clean it, you're going to season it, baby. And you know what you're going to do? You're going to get that Pretty Girls No Flavor seasoning. And I'm only going in with one tablespoon of seasoning for four fish. Do y'all see that? I only have one tablespoon for fish and a little bit of olive oil and when i told you it was time to rub it down i rubbed it down and that thing is seasoned tell me that thing is not seasoned tell me that you need to add anything else because that don't need nothing else added to it okay baby so now we're gonna get our oil hot and yes, I'm going to drop in a few pieces of garlic just because I'm trying it out to see if it really adds any more flavor. And then I'm going to do my flour test. And that thing was ready, so I'm dropping it in there. And I love that sizzle. So after we got our fish in here, we're going to get it nice and crispy on both sides. I like my fish fried extra crispy. I like it extra hard. If you don't like yours extra crispy and you like it soft, then you fry it how you like it. And I'm going to fry mine how I like it. But just make sure that when you're frying it, you fry it until it's done. So now that we have our fish done, we're going to get another pan and we're going to throw in some garlic. We're going to throw in those peppers. We're going to throw in some onions. We're going to throw in some carrots. And we are going to throw in some oil spice and we're gonna put a little bit of oil and we're just gonna cook that down a little bit after we get that cooked down so they're almost soft you want to go ahead and throw in that scotch bonnet so i went and chopped up two scotch bonnet peppers baby when i tell you maybe i just should have used one because that thing was spicy but it was good after i got my scotch bonnet in there you're gonna go ahead and throw in your vinegar and you're gonna add some sugar to balance out the acidity and after i was done my escovitch was ready my rice had already been cooked and fluffed and ready to be plated and it was time to eat and any time that it is time to eat is the best time for me so go ahead get your seasoning get your bundle shop my website and go ahead and cook for them children and that man at home